Hey guys, I welcome you to... I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce this word. Crepellen? Crepellen? Hmm. Feel free to leave a comment below on how to pronounce that word. I probably should have Googled it before I did this. But it is essentially an audio-based psychological horror game with a budget in space. I'm not entirely sure one can put horror on a budget. 1980s horror, probably, maybe. But let's go. So, I've got the audio set to maximum, in case there are very quiet noises. Well, that's my torch, which appears to be a lantern. You would have thought that would be more expensive. I need to get the generator back on. Uh-huh. Oh, God. Doom-style doors. I had that in the last game as well. Oh, I see. Yep. Well, I've got the audio on max, so... Yeah, maybe it's a thriller style. Thriller style means it'll be quiet and unnerving. But if it's jump scary, I'll be screaming quite a lot. <clears throat> Should I continue or go in there? I don't know. Can I go back? Ooh, I don't know. But I guess I'll go through this door. But what's concerning me is that through these portholes, that door leads to space. No, but there is a bookshelf here. Ooh. I heard a noise. Someone just got shot. The audio is on max, so be nice. I can go back to where I came. That's not good. I better remember. We better go door to door then. Oh, there's nothing here. Can I run? I cannot run. I am stuck. Wearing a space suit, which very nervously seems to have my logo on his shoulder. That's just unnerving. We're on a budget, we're fine. We cannot even afford a helmet. I'm not going in there. Can I die? Definitely not going to go in there, though. Oh, great. There's an SCP with me. It's locked. Ooh, an elevator here. I'll take that. No! <laughs> The light went out. Well, that's not good. Great, I can't even afford fire. Bathroom. Urinals. Clearly the men's. Thank goodness for gravity, that's all I'll say. God, what would happen if you're using a urinal and all of a sudden the gravity was to switch off? Oh, perish the thought. Hello. The medical bay. I don't know what that is, but it looks nervously like one of my colleagues. Did I kill someone? Whatever that noise is, that clickety clackety noise, it's getting louder. Sounds like a typewriter. Good, I was expecting something scary to come out on those screens. Oh, nothing here. There's a fair amount of place for me to explore. I've got a feeling I'll be using that at a later date. 
this place is huge. Maybe my space helmet is a fishbowl. That would seem quite the classic for a budget psychological horror. What's even more unnerving is that I don't even have a mouth. Can't afford a mouth. The generator. Everything is online. Yay! Isn't that great? I'm going to take a snapshot of that. Might make a good thumbnail, I don't know. Maybe I'll graft whatever this creature is in there as well. Now where do I go? I swear that's my logo on this side. one that is Frappellen. It does exactly what it promised. A psychological thriller horror style game on a budget in space. I think this will make a nice addition to my Dream Hacker Game Jam playlist. There are a lot of submissions for this. It all seems to be focused on a horror in space, which um, which, this could appeal to me. Stay tuned for some more games, horror-like or otherwise, and I'll see you soon. Keep playing.